And this is Roshan Johnson in. Pass to Sanders wide open. And that could be the pick to click. Fast catchers. What makes him even more special is the fact that he can block. Obviously, there's a busted assignment here. Someone's got to be on Sanders as he runs almost like a mini wheel route to the flat and up in the end zone. But Johnson moves up. Here's pressure on the run to Gunner Helm. Down conversion for the Horns tonight. Casey Kane makes the catch. Slips one tackle to the left side. 40-yard line. The Louisiana kid cutting it up. And C. Kane with a huge game. Wide receiver number three. You never, people say next man up. You never know when your opportunity is going to be. Isaiah Nayor, the transfer from Wyoming, gets. Little pop pass. Worthy. 10-yard line. Notice how Sark is trying to get you. It's a good jump off the line. A little screen to Bijan. And Bijan takes it to the 45-yard line. Viewers standing on the 50. To Sanders. Makes a man miss. Lowers the shoulder. And Tony back. Bijan Robinson stayed in a little bit to protect. He made sure everything was clear. Offensive line held up great. Jatavion Sanders. Forces a missed tackle. Get so ULM with five guys at the 10-yard line. And there's in the words of the staff, the most consistent player on the offensive line. His viewers were scramble. And before he got to the line, the flip to Sanders. Sanders showing the speed. Tripped up. Looking as Driggers is able to make that shoestring stop. And you notice Quinn Ewers, you know, sorry, almost, almost did a low look pass. His eyes are downfield, downfield, downfield. But he knows that to the left side with a little more experience to help out Kelvin Banks. And when you do it right, it leads to that. For running back to catch the ball out of the backfield. And then Jordan Whittington, you have to block. Look at the way he's still on his block. He might still be blocking the defensive back. Jordan Whittington making that block kept that is what made that play into a touchdown. You don't make that block as a receiver. Good with the intermediary, intermediary and short routes. On the money to Jordan Woodington. That's the biggest question for number four. It is, and he lost 15 pounds in this offseason. Started eating better. He, he Says he wouldn't change his career path for anything. Nice touch to Sanders. Championship between Ewers and Jatavion Sanders. Notice the ease in which that ball was thrown. Quinn Ewers, there was no, like some players would have to You see it creep up here early. First down, Ewers to the sideline. Nice throw, good catch. Ewers flicks it out. Nice catch. Winning to the game, turns it up, picks up another first. Last week, Ewers underneath and it's a catch. 16. Brian Branch covering. Play fake. Deep drop. Ewers looking. Ewers throws it. Nice grab. Whittington again. Watches Ewers is going to have to wait. This is not what he wants against this pass rush. He wants to go down the field, but then great job by Whittington to break off his route to go back to the left, and he's able to find him and get the completion right before Toa Toa comes in there and hits him from that linebacker position. What a great completion for Quinn Ewers there. Worthy in motion. He's a danger. Here's Ewers. Winds up. Let's it go. Worthy! Hey! Got it inside the five! Take a look at when Ewers throws this ball. This is great anticipation on the deep ball and frankly something that he didn't show last week in his first start. Look at where the receivers are. He just lets this one go down the field. You talk about trusting the shot down the field and there's Worthy in his speed. Showing. It's out in the slot on second and seven. Ewers will get it complete for a first down to Whittington. Let's see if Burnt Orange for 50% of this cotton bowl. Ewers, easy pitch and catch to Whittington. And he's inside the 30-yard line. Clemson, D.C., 7.30 on ABC. When Ewers extends the play and a reaching effort by Whittington. Ewers turns around, goes back to Johnson. Well-designed play. Roshan ripping it up. Big gainer, chunk play, horns. These Oklahoma Sooners move to their left initially as Ewers rolls to his left to buy a little time. Turns around, finds Johnson, and he's out. Ewers out of the backfield. Robinson is interesting as he came with the reverse motion. He actually he sees, he kind of slips. 
But this is a good job by Ewers, feeling that pressure. The ball's on the 10-yard line. Ewers to the end zone! Touchdown! Result, you just have the post right in behind it. Easy pitch and catch. So far today's their own 15, and they have two long touchdown drives. Ewers. It works so easy for him right now. To... Yeah, he can throw it, and it's really easy to in the offensive line. You got a pocket like that. And to allow your receivers to. Ewers trying to find an option. Third and six, and Bijan Robinson. Ridiculous catch. I mean, this is not worthy. This is not a receiver. This is a running back. This is Robinson on second and six. Keelan Robinson! See if the Sooners defense can get a stop on third and 11. When Ewers pressured, he's going to tuck, run, try to get there, and he does. As you can see, Ewers stepping up, didn't like anything downfield, and Oklahoma dropping all the way deep in coverage, knowing that Ewers is in remaining. Ewers, look at this! J.T. Sanders. What a throw on the seam. It's pretty well covered. It's pretty well defended. But you have a. There's Ewers on second and seven as he gets it complete. <laughs> as you can see, the ump right there just almost getting out of the way. <laughs> and the rest is history. Second and seven, Ewers easily goes to Whittington for another first down, and they're in some this time. He kind of throws it off his back foot, but drops it right over the top of the defender and right into the hands of Whittington. Just an excellent job as Whittington works a cool to see who's with you and who's against you down the road. That's a very good point. Just simply effort at this point when you see a scroll. That's really what you want. Is you want the middle and the bottom to be that good. So the end zone and add to the day for Quinn Ewers. They're in the red zone. Look at the two Sooner defenders following number eight worthy. That opens up one on one on the post route crossing face for the big body Sanders. When you have a dynamic wide receiver, you can't leave them in one on ones from their own 41 yard line. Ewers. to the 35, across the field to Xavier Worthy. Look at him in the pocket, calm feet, beautiful delivery, nice catch by Xavier Worthy. Ewers caught in. Right now, unable to get him tracked offensively. Ewers took a hit, got it away, complete to his tight end, Sanders. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the hit well, was a block one, yeah. Ewers gets it out quickly, got a little bit of room on the edge, Whittington. Ninth play of the drive, little play action into the end zone. Football, and then what do they do? They go to their X. They found him. Johnny on the spot, goes up, high points the ball. They go empty, five receivers on this play. Ewers over the middle, there he is to five. Come out of the first half. One yeah. more look. Yeah, you see Quinn Ewers makes a nice throw, but it's a little hard. Bijan goes up and catches it, and it's not just the catch, guys. First and goal. Ewers on the slant. Texas is a violent runner. He's not just speed. He's power. Off the play fake. Wide open at the 47-yard line. Caught by Worthy. And on third down today. They set up a screen. Robinson. Into the end zone. Did that look easy? Yes, Robert. they did. When you play defense like Iowa State, it gives you one on one matchups on the out. Syracuse. Ewers to pass. Gets leveled as he throws a deep ball. And it's on target. It's caught. Guards. When he took it right on the chin. Max protection, only a two receiver route. And an excellent route there by Worthy. He gets behind the defense. Play action, Ewer setting up and dumps it off, and it's a great call. Inside the five and into the end zone for the touchdown is Xavier Worthy. Just how creative the imagination he uses with all these compliments of receivers. Only about a, a quarter motion, and then he motions. 
Play fake Ewers. Over the middle, it's caught for a first down. Out past the 40-yard line, Jordan Whittington. One-yard pickup. Ewers to throw here. Going for Robinson is open. Caught inside the 20. A breakdown defensively, and Robinson makes another house call. Blown coverage, and nobody keeps sight of B. John Robinson. Looks like they're in man-to-man coverage, and nobody identifies and goes with Bijan. Second and 10. And they're going to throw it out in the flat to Thompson. He's got room inside the 30. Thompson inside the 20. And on the 34, Texas. Ewers over the middle. That was a dart. On third and 10. And you want to talk about a tight window throw. It's good coverage by Mason Cobb and Benson. you got to fit it in a very small space. And the Longhorns turned it over on downs. Here's Ewers. Only 11 completions on the day. And dumps that one off to Worthy, who's got the first down pass. And Worthy wrapped up at the 45 and mightily through the air. Looks like maybe a broken play. Either that or defined play action, whatever it works. To the season, he was suspended the first six games of the year. It's a gain of 20. Boy, deep over route there for Jill Billingsley. Excellent hand. It's all year and a big stop on first down. Ewers steps up, has room to run past the 40-yard line. Ewers in the Oklahoma State territory all the way to the 34-yard line. Three timeouts. We'll see what Ewers does in third and 22. Over the middle, it's caught at the 40-yard line. Short is Sanders, but for Ewers. Pressure up the middle, long throw. Ewers is on the money and caught. 36, second down and 10. Ewers sidearms it, caught at the 45 and out of bounds. Is kind of takes Bijan Robinson out of the game, really. Here's a throw, back shoulder, caught inside the 40. Third down and nine for Ewers, spinning the ball, ready to throw down the middle, and he's got it right at the line to gain. A couple years ago, one of five five stars on this Texas roster, and that's one of those elite corners. That's Echo Boydo, but you see the difference in size. Ewers rolling and throwing the other way. It's Robinson. That is beautiful design, and B. John Robinson was going to get lost amidst the chaos, and you can see the backs turn and run. Ewers, this side, nicely planted there at the 20-yard line for Sanders. Oh, this is trust. There's three Wildcats right there. Kind of like the first third here. Left and then to the top of the screen. And Ewers goes down the middle. And again, the tight end, Jatavion Sanders. Is Ewers makes it look so easy sometimes. With the spin rate. Right, Fromber Valdez tonight. Look at how quickly he gets spin. I'm not a good golfer, but I've golfed with men like Trent. Six. Pocket holds up. Ewers. End zone. He does have Worthy. Ewers. End zone. And the toe tap for Worthy. He gets to figure out where the stress needs to go on his defense. Not tonight. Oh. Look at that spiral again. I'm telling you, when you watch Steph Curry, when you watch Steph Curry shoot, you wonder how in the world does he get so much backspin so quickly? Not Ewers gets it away. It's worthy on the cross into Kansas State territory and then some with a dance move. All about the protection. Look at this. It looks like a punt block from K-State. And the big guys up front, they scat, re release, everybody is out. They run the crossers. And once again, back to back. Activity that they have right now, they're just going up against two good defenses. Ewers has time and delivers a pitch, and Sanders finally makes the catch this time. But no clue. It, it was more of kind of a did you know to tie in TCU yeah. because in 2014. Oh, we got a completion. Hold for everything. A doubt. Warming up, hoping he gets a shot to tie this game. Ewers delivers a shot near midfield. Corn Frog defense. Second and ten, yours, and a completion, and that's Worthy. Yours flips it, and that is an accurate pitch for a first down out across the 30. Needs great job by Yours. Hodges Tomlinson kind of stays up in the flat, goes up and over him, gets it in there just in time. Remember, this tight end Sanders has wide receiver skill set, 6'4", 242. In command, up ten here on the edge. Whittington makes a couple guys miss. Jordan Whittington's got great speed. This is 40. Ewers 
Catch made, first down, that's Sanders. Really tight, Ewers gets back, makes the read, he works a wrap. Defense has been really good after halftime. Shot to the end zone, and short of that is... Boy, how about the little move underneath the other big tight end? He gets behind him, and then... Talking to the big guys up front there. He sure is. DJ Campbell in there. That's a great... Just tonight isn't very little running the football. Ewers took a long look, and then finally tucks it. On the move, looks to throw back to his left, flips it short. And catch made by Sanders. Re win in Austin. That'll be huge. Ewers flips it over the middle, and the catch is made by Whittington. Takes a third and six. Ewers complete. Worthy in stride across the 30 and Worthy just a little too speedy. Yeah, that's best receiver on best cover. Machilla, tough situation for him. Meanwhile, Ewers rainbow delivery. Hauled in by Jordan Whittington. Quinn Ewers here stepping into this while taking a shot. He gives it a little air early because Whittington was so clean. Down so far in the first half today. Swing it. The other Robinson with a burst of speed. Oh, he's in. Touchdown. Reception. Kansas will get the football to start the second half after, ten, after Texas won the toss and elected to receive. You are showing off the legs as spun down across the 45. The score 24 points. The rest of the team, 17 points. They fake the jet sweep. Ewers wide open at the 40 yard line. Pots made by Sanders. St Ewers keeps it and scores. Touchdown, Texas. Robinson and still in the backfield. Ewers on the throwback. Sanders the tight end. As you're gonna see Quinn Ewers do a little fake look. Eye candy, semi roll to the right, looking for the deep shot. Oh, somebody shows up. I'll just drop it down for a nice dime on a deep cross to my. Whittington in motion, then sets at the wing. Ewers fires complete. Worthy. Baylor bringing pressure. Good move by Ewers to get away. Completes the pass, but it's going to be short. Is he looking to be positive, or is he looking to enhance their mistakes? Well, there's a solution there, Q. The pass complete to Jordan oh. Whittington. It's on the ground. It came loose, and the Bears have it. Ewers comes to Xavier Worthy. And Worthy, every game he's played in college, it's 25th consecutive. And now Jordan Whittington. Ewers swings it out. Nice catch and a big first down for Casey Kane. And he takes it down the sideline to set up Texas. Were dialed up. There was no hesitation. You see Kane, he's a receiver lining up in the backfield. Some confusion for the Washington linebackers about who to identify, who's got the back out of the backfield. It's a receiver. Just a great job of having that play and calling it quick. Now, you can see in his eyes and in his words that Xavier Worthy has been frustrated by it. It hooks up with him here. A lot of soft zone coverage to the boundary and the field. So every time you just take it. Going to the slant. That's Xavier Worthy for the catch. So he's Stroud, Ryan Day in Ohio State. And now they go play action on third and short. Ewers trying to run for it, and he picks it up with his legs. Well, to start this game, pressure up the middle, picked up, and he slings it to his tight end, Jatavion Sanders. Your career as a head coach, you learn to be your own man and your own voice. He's tight end, Sanders, and a big gain for a Texas first down on a pickup of 16. Ewers slings it out, and that one's... Xavier Worthy, or not. And instead, they go behind Worthy to Jordan Whittington for a look. Ewers has nowhere to go at the moment. Then he slip, slips one out to Worthy. Held on to this one and took it for a gain of 21. Sophomore out of Honolulu. Ewers goes to his tight end. Sanders. Play action again. And he's able to get it out to Jonathan Brooks. Brooks all the way! Touchdown, Texas! The notoriety that he came here with from Ohio State. 
adds more pressure. There's Robinson out of the backfield. Ewers goes over the middle, lobs it. Where well, he's got another drop. Four man rush. Ewers fits it in. That's a first down. After a drop like that, you just need an easy one like this. And there it is. And Worthy takes it inside the 40. The they bring a linebacker. Ewers the out route. And that's good for a first down to Jordan Whittington. New two minute drill. You get back to your day one install, week one install, fall camp plays that you know like the back of your hand. On second and 10, over the middle, wide open. A Texas first down inside the 10. Ewers pulls it back, got a key block, swings it out, and a full head of steam for Kane. And he Ewers complete again to Kane, and he got room to run. On second and 10. Ewers is going to tuck it and rumble, and he's got a Texas first down. Huskies drop two safeties back to midfield. Ewers unloads. They're just going Hail Mary, and that one is caught, and the clock shows triple zero.